the riders gathering at the gate now for the opening heat of this match. I'll remind you, Hackney versus Edinburgh. On the inside, we have in red, Trevor Banks. Next to him in yellow and black, Bobby Beaton. Gate three in blue, Mark Terry. And gate four in white, Mark Fiora. Well, due to those work permit problems, Mark Fiora has only ridden in two league matches so far. That's two out of six. He missed the, four match the first four matches while waiting for his uh, chance to ride for the team. Now he's very hungry for points. Well, showing first into the turn, it's Trevor Banks. Second in yellow and black is Beaton. Third in white is Fiora. Very strong pairing for the Monarchs here. And Beaton slips through underneath Banks for the lead. And there goes Fiora as well. And Edinburgh have the 5-1. And Trevor Banks, no slouch around this Walston Road circuit. He's certainly laboring though in this one. Scored a maximum last week against Rye House, but having problems here in heat one. Well, Edinburgh going with a Grand Slam pairing in the opening heat of Beaton and Fiora, their top two. And pulling off the 5-1 that they badly need to set themselves up for this meeting. Hackney very much dominant here at Walston Road this year. They've yet to be threatened in any form of match, apart from that opening challenge match that we covered between the Kestrels and Milton Hall, where it was just a two-point victory. Since then, there's been nothing less than a ten-point win. And looks like Edinburgh are going to be stern opposition here tonight. Edinburgh are expected to struggle with their injury problems, but coming up trumps in heat number one. Around the final turn, it's going to be a 5-1 for Edinburgh. First man home, Bobby Beaton. Second in white, Mark Fiora. Third in red, Trevor Banks. Not often Banks gets the third place here. And fourth in blue, completely out of it, young Mark Terry.